rest of my collection, you know, um, as far as mixtapes and shit, dig, I got hella mixtapes in there, you know, that's one book, this was the other books I didn't get to show y'all, so, you know, you gotta go through there, see a lot of mixtapes in there, then you got these little joints right here. I don't know why I zipped it up though. Hold on. There you go. Couple in there. Same thing with this one. Hold on. So it's a lot of music, man. Like that's the crazy part of it, you know. Chris Webby, Gene, first mixtape. Just a lot of random shit. See, favorite big crit right here, Forever in a Day, man. Remember, that was dope as fuck, too. Uh, you got like, this little motherfucker right here. So what I'm basically doing, I'm trying to get all my mixtapes that's official together. Kobe Trice joint. Your body, you got some, you know, just some different type shit. Uh, Kasky, last mixtape, Young Chris, Freeway and shit. Just some different shit, man. So for a lot of people that don't be understanding it, I fuck with a lot of artists that don't be understanding it. It's like, I ain't new to this shit, you know, I'm true to this shit, you know. A couple joints in there. Don't ask me why I was listening to Lil B. Like, some of this shit was cool, man. Party Next Door, he did. Been up on him. It just at one point, Soldier Boy and fucking um, Lil B was just dropping a lot of shit. That's why you see a lot of Soldier Boy. So that's why when I critique him so much, it's just because I don't know why the fuck he picked this out. Cam, that was the most wacky shit. Vampire Life, you know, the first edition. You know. Fred the Godson, J Hood, Angel Hayes, just a little different shit like that. I mean, 50, Carnival T. There's a lot of other shit, man. I'm not gonna go through everything, but it's a lot of shit in here, man. LEP. See, Ball Out. Remy, classic, classic. Gilly the Kids, Who Serve. You know, just some of the shit I listen to. Of course, you see the whole GB 300. I was on that shit for a cool minute. You dig? So, when it comes to music, man, SD, man, straight up. I fucking do this, man. A lot of good music. And imagine if I never burnt none of these. You dig? It'd just be music on my laptop. You know, just going through. Loaded Lux, boy. You don't know about that. You slipping. Free JR Rider, you know. But this was actually um, Young Chris last CD. I mean, mixtape. I never really got into it because it was so fucking long. Pause. You know, but. And you got this one. I'm not even supposed to be shooting this video. I'm supposed to be motherfucking organizing this shit. But as you see, see, fuck with Reed Dallas, but that shit was kind of whack. Just a lot of different shit. So when people be asking me about certain artists and this and that, I be fucking with them. Shout out to Filthy Rich. See, look, Reed, man. See? So when I be critiquing artists and shit like that, for a purpose I'm not being a hater It's just I listen to their music And so I know what the fuck I'm talking about Then again to the album So You know We on the night Panic at the disco See I listen to a lot of different shit though You know what I'm saying These are all the albums That came out That either I couldn't find Of course I bought that Or that shit was dope. The price for the CD. It's the only motherfucking CD I still gotta buy. As you see, I gave that CD away to somebody. 
Fuck that bitch though. Shady asshole. But um yeah. A lot of shit. People still hated on that shit. Said why the fuck did they do that? It's pretty dope. Uh Asher Roth, of course, super dope. Y'all remember that. It's different shit, man. See? Back when Ransom was fucking with uh the little beef joint, Los. That joint, while you was sleeping, John Connor, man. So, I really do a lot when it comes to music. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to get into everything, but. Uh, look how big this motherfucker is. So, look at that. That's a lot of fucking CDs, man. This, this different shit. I had my slaughterhouse phase. And, it's a lot of bunch of different shit. Some of these are official, some of them are just random. You know. Lil Debbie. That shit was hard. That's all. Diggy first shit. That shit was dope. So that's why I'm like straightening up my um books now to get uh RP Lil Snoop. Lil Snoop roasted that nigga in the battle. If y'all go on YouTube, look up Lil Snoop versus Jackpot. I think that's that nigga. Whoever he is, but a uh, little Snoop toasted his ass in the motherfucking um, battle. Soldier Boy, of course. Just a lot of random shit. That's why I'm saying, like, you got some official shit in here, and then some shit you don't. So, that's why I gotta organize it. So, when y'all talk that J. Cole shit, man, I've been a fan of J. Cole for the longest. I told y'all, man. You feel me? I've been a fan of this nigga. He just ain't the same no more. I know about that But back to what I was saying Like yeah I gotta just Go ahead and Put this These motherfuckers together From you know Authentic releases To the bullshit Cause the bullshit That I don't really listen to I need to either Throw the motherfuckers away Or some shit Cause I don't really listen to them I don't know shit Maybe that'll be a Fucking good boy this Package up some of these fucking mixtapes and give them away, you know, but that's just too many books, man. I don't want to show every fucking book, you know, that's just a lot of fucking work to go through every book. I think I showed y'all that. Wait, did I show that? That one? Yeah, I showed that one. And this one, I showed y'all this one. Yeah, that's the um, Young Money one, so I actually don't need